Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Let's go. Let's go. Come on, come on, come on in this morning, this afternoon, this evening. Yes, sir. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, hey, listen. Did you know, did you know, man, I want to tell you something. Let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. You know the Lord loves you, right? <laughs> hey, come on. No, 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 no. For real. Don't take that lightly. Like, listen, listen. The Lord loves you, man. I'm, I'm for real. Like, the Lord loves you with all his heart. Look at your hands right now. Look at your hands. Look at your hands, right? Mm-hmm. That's God. <laughs> all right. All right. Look at the next thing. Look Look at your feet. Uh, come on now. It don't matter how they look. Come on now. Look at your feet. That's God. <laughs> come on. Come on. You got kids? Look at your kids. Uh-huh. That's God. Okay. All right. All right. What else? What else? What else? Look at everything that the Lord has provided. Woo! That's God. All right. So, with all that being said, God can do anything. Come on, man. He can do anything. Yes. Yes. See? See? I'm looking at right now, I'm looking at the, I'm in St. Augustine, Florida, and I'm looking at the White Lion Bridge, and I'm looking at how the bridge is open up, and then he's allowing, they allow sailboats to go to and fro. They go to and fro, whoop, whoop, whoop. They go in and out, in and out, right? But they're sitting, whoo, you ain't hear me. <laughs> you ain't hearing the young preacher this morning. They are floating, they are moving on a body of water. Woo! Who, who created it? Who created the water? Huh? God. Who created the ferment? Huh? God. Who created all things? Who created all things, brothers and sisters? God. So I tell you this morning, I tell you this afternoon, that the Lord is able. Amen. He is able. To save you from falling. Let me show you. Let me show you. In the book of Acts chapter 4. Starting at verse 10. It says. Then now this. Woo. This. You and all the people of Israel. It is by the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Whom you crucified. But whom God. Elohim. Yes. God raised from the dead. That this man stands before you healed. Jesus is the stone you believers rejected, which has become the cornerstone. Salvation, verse 12, salvation is found in no one else, for there is no other name. Come on now. There is no other name under the heaven given to mankind by which we must be saved. Thank you, Lord. There is no other name, huh? There is no other way. There is no other uh, 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 potion. There is no other man. There is no entity. There is no other L. There is no other G. When you look at the world and you look at America, you see so many statues of this and that and this and this and that. And all of them have a backstory. You know, all of them have this story and that story. But Jesus, Yeshua, Yehovah, Yahweh, Jehovah, Jehovah Nisi, El Shaddai, <laughs> was, is the only one that was risen, that was raised back, that was risen from the grave that was resurrected and is the only one that is alive today. Come on, somebody. Spiritually, I'm speaking here. See, that's the kind of God that we serve. And for you to be saved, there is no other name in heaven that is given to mankind by which you must be saved. When they saw the courage of Peter and John... And realized that they were unschooled, ordinary men, that they were astonished. And they look to notice that these men have been with Jesus. See, I don't need the big name. I don't need the big numbers. I don't need this and I don't need that. I don't need all this stuff. I ain't got to be schooled and doctrinated by man. Thank you, Father. 
We, some of you, listen, listen, a lot of us are running to and fro. A lot of us are trying to gain this degree, that degree, this and this and that and this and get with the big people and get with all these other people so you can be seen and so you can be saved. And you're saying, Lord, look at what all I have done. Lord, look at all this. Lord, look at all that. But the Lord says, no, listen, I am not, I am not wooed by your, by your speech. I'm not wooed, huh? I'm not wooed by your, 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 uh, your doctor degree. Come on, somebody. I'm not wooed by this and I'm not wooed by that. I'm not even wooed that you a CEO of a Fortune 500 company. Come on, somebody. I am the only one. <laughs> I am the only one that can save. Huh? I am the way. Huh? And I am the truth. And I am the life. And no man can come unto Elohim. No man can come unto his father. <laughs> except through him. So I'm telling somebody today. That when you look at life. And when you look at the things of life. Know that God created the heavens and earth. Know that God created you. Know that you cannot go any, any other way to get into the kingdom except through his son. That's why Jesus said in the book of Acts chapter 4, at verse 12, Salvation is found in no one else, for there is no other name under the heavens given to mankind by which we, we, he didn't say I, he didn't say one, he didn't say some, he didn't say none, he didn't say just a certain name. He says we must be saved. Amen? So I pray that this message found you in perfect shalom. You know, I don't like to make them long. I just like to make these podcasts short and sweet. But I like to give you a lot of meat in a short period of time. Thank you through the Holy Spirit. Oh, brothers and sisters, the Lord is doing a mighty, mighty thing here in Jacksonville, Florida. He's doing a mighty thing here everywhere in the world. I, I, it, we, we may look at it as a lot of things that are going on. And it is. It is. I'm not taking that away. But at the end of the day, you... Uh, you reap what you sow. You sow good seeds in a harvest. You shall reap it back tenfold. And a lot of us are uh, putting out things in this life. I don't even know why I'm going here, but the Holy Spirit taking me there. A lot of us are putting out things in this life. And we're wondering why we're going through so much hell. Because we are reaping what we have sowed. Hmm. Sometimes we will reap things in life. Because we have sowed some bad seeds down the road. Somewhere in our past we have sold some seeds. Somewhere in our past we have done things. That's why we got to know how to remove those things out of our life and be saved by the only name which is in heaven. That man can be saved here on earth and that's through Jesus Christ. So I pray that this message found you in purpose alone. Remember, you can find me on Facebook at Ramon Minister Grupo on Facebook.com. Also, you know, I want to say something, man. I looked at it yesterday on my statistics, and I don't care about statistics too much, but I just looked at statistics on the podcast, and I noticed 90, uh, 79 downloads on yesterday. Uh, God bless you. God bless you, man. I mean, really, really, God bless you. The website is coming up. Uh, I'll be sending y'all guys, shooting y'all guys to a website for the ones that don't have social media. Uh, my website should be up by Friday. Uh, uh, once I get the website up, guys, listen, you can go over to the website. Uh, uh, my Facebook feed will upload every two hours on the, on the, on the website, man. It's going to be a blessing over there. Um, my TikTok, uh, Facebook, YouTube, and Instagram will be uploaded right there uh, 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 on the website. Uh, you can drop your prayer requests there. Uh, the Cash App is there. Uh, the Lord has uh, 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 doing some things. I can't speak about it too soon, too fast yet. But the Lord is doing some things here in 2022 for my ministry. Uh, I'm still out there watching on the wall, still out the street preaching. Like I said, you can find me on TikTok. Come on, you can find me on TikTok. Um, on TikTok at Watchman underscore 904777 on TikTok. Pushing almost 11,000 followers on TikTok. Thank the Lord. Come on, let's give him a hand. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord, for that. So, pushing 11,000 followers right there on TikTok. Uh, Facebook is growing well. Uh, Got to get a little bit more harder on Instagram, but... Guys, it's all about getting a message out here. That's what it takes. And like I said, for you, the ones that listen to this on uh, iTunes, iHeartRadio, Spotify, Spreaker, all these places, I thank you for your ears. I really do. I'm telling you, listen, none of this is done by Kawinkity. None of this is done by any other way but through Jesus Christ. If you need prayer, listen to me. If you need prayer, if you want uh, uh, someone that is standing in the gap, come on, someone that is standing in the gap here in the last days, uh, you can email me at Ramon, R-A-M-O-N-E, Prince, P-R-I-N-C-E, at gmail.com. You can email me your prayer request, put it in there. I will get it 
done. We will get it done through the Holy Spirit. Amen. I have brothers and sisters that's in the faith that are willing to stand in the gap for you. So be blessed. Be encouraged. Be in Jacksonville, Florida anytime in 2022. Anytime. You can look me up. Hit me up. We can break bread. Baptisms are still going on. Baptisms will be going on here in this year. I got a, got a really good feeling that the Lord is going to move. So just be encouraged. Be blessed. King coming. Shalom. Fall on us right now, sweet spirit. Fall on me right now. I feel your presence. 